Welcome to Snail Trail 4x4. Today I'm going to show you my first addition to the Tacoma. All right, so here's the inside of my truck. Uh, it's very basic for the most part. I mean, it's completely stock. Came with the floor mats, came with the, the step guards. Everything else, you know, is the way it came. So the first thing that I'm going to be talking about and modifying today. Oh, did you see? I got a manual. Boom. It's so much fun to drive a manual. So the first thing today I'm going to be talking about is I got an organizer. This, the glove box or this uh, um, center console just comes empty with nothing in it. And so I got this tray organizer offline and it's super basic. I like actually having some coins along um, in the rig with me at all times. If I'm going downtown, I can use the coins and meters and you know, sometimes you just need some extra change for whatever. And in my rig, there's no other coin holders. I was putting them in like where the cup holders were, but then when I go get drinks, you know, it just makes a mess and it's all over the place. Yeah, I didn't have a coin holder and I wanted to solve that. And this tray actually solved that solution plus some other benefits. You know, it's got some other dividers in there so I can store things on the top. My sunglasses actually fit in there where they don't fit in the overhead part. I like the fact that it has that hole. You can see my finger sliding back here. So I can pull a cord up from the bottom if I choose and then I can charge things inside of there. I'm not sure if that bottom plug is full time when the car is off or not. That would be really cool because then I could charge something while the car is off. Um, and the dividers are, seem pretty neat. I'm not quite sure how functional they're gonna be for me. I might want to have that bigger open space underneath. You can pull this apart, actually. It's kind of a pain to get out. You gotta kind of turn it, twist it. So. You can actually take one of these, you know, slide these off. Ah, there you go. So you can take these apart. I might run it like that. That might be kind of interesting to have um, sort of a long and a short divider, and then I can have some space for other things. Um, but I'm gonna play with it um, a little bit more. But I'm really enjoying having this little addition of the tray and having it spaced. It's got um, rubber mats down here that come with it, and it was really nice. I bought two of these. I bought one that come, came with the dividers and I bought one that didn't. And they're the same tray, the same top. So I have an extra one and I'm probably gonna give it away. I'll figure out what I'm gonna do with that here soon. So if anybody's looking for one, stay, pay attention. I'll uh, probably be doing a little giveaway on Instagram for it, because I don't need two. Um, so we'll figure it out. So I like this divider, it's super easy. It's literally, you just, you saw me pull it out. You kind of have to twist it to put those um, dividers back in, but the tray sits right on top and that's it. There's like no install to it. But what I like about it is that it fits really well. It didn't collide with anything. You know, the tray and the dividers fit in there, not a problem. The top closes, you don't have to press it extra hard to shut it with a, you know, a little bit of space for that tray. I appreciate you watching. If you are looking for a tray like this, they can grab them on Amazon. I'll put a link down below. Uh, I'm excited to do some more upgrades on this Tacoma. And so don't forget, keep crawling.